What is up? Welcome to this video. I'm going to be making a sort of a styling video on uh, styling for the Yeezy 500 High Tactical Boots and, and specifically in the sand colorway. Um, I think black is pretty straightforward, but you know, people have been asking me about the sand colorway. Okay, like what do I wear them with? And um, this first bit right here, I just kind of want to go over uh, just in general what I would um, put into an outfit with these. So first things first, socks. These are the Yeezy, um, the Yeezy.com uh, ivory socks. So, um, but it, they don't have to be this specific sock. They can just be, you know, any white sock or um, ivory similar tannish color sock. And um, I choose these because I, I wear these boots with uh, cuffed joggers at the end with the compression. So, um, in, you know, they, they tuck into the boot really nicely but um you know they can lift up and reveal the sock and i just found that it looks better if i'm wearing a um a lighter color sock now if i'm wearing a black jogger and it pulls up and you can kind of see it through the uh through the top of the shoe then uh, maybe black socks would work out better for that for the contrast but um that's just my preference there. Another thing you'll see, I'm not just uh, styling for summer. I'll have my hoodies in here. So I got a, I got this tan hoodie and um, I also have a black hoodie over here, but the black hoodie kind of has like that ivory accent with the, uh, with the pull strap. So I think that'll look really nice. You know, the thing about wearing these boots with, um, with any, uh, black clothing, I feel like you gotta balance it out with some kind of accessory. So you're gonna see in all these outfits, I'm gonna be wearing this specific hat because it just goes perfectly with these boots. And um, yeah, I wouldn't want, you know, all black and just no accent to complement the uh, sand uh, colorway of these. And uh, as far as just like normal shirts, although these are anything but normal, I got my tan cotton on shirts right here. And I also have this same exact shirt, but in a black colorway. So let's, oh yeah, I also got jeans. I'm gonna see what these things look like with jeans. I've never tried them on with jeans. So when I put them on the video, it will be my first time wearing these with jeans. So uh, we're gonna try all this stuff out and um, go from there. All right, so this is my preferred outfit, my most preferred outfit for these boots. Although the ones coming up, you, there's one that I kind of like more than this, but uh, that's been kind of growing on me, especially since it's getting towards the fall time. But uh, yeah, just short sleeve, uh, collar, cotton on shirt. Uh, I, I think the texture even goes well with the suede. And um, yeah, just keeping this one mostly, you know, uniform in the color tone, just all the way from head to toe. So not a lot of contrast going on, but especially when you get in the light, when all the colors, like right now I'm in my office area and the lighting is all over the place but especially when you get outside and the sunlight hits it it starts to be all a little bit more uniform a little bit brighter so um and yeah I've gotten a lot of compliments on this outfit like it, it's pe people it, especially it, it just works out and I mean Steven just styled these things so nicely and uh, I, I got a I got a couple of questions about okay can these work in the army too this is sort of an army you know s kind of look that we have going on here and yeah people have definitely gravitated towards uh, possibly using these in the army and um all the feedback that i've gotten from that was that hey uh they just have to be uh coyote brown or maybe like a darker tone to work out there but um yeah th this outfit in particular has been a conversation starter when i've been out at cafes and whatnot so yeah really cool and i just like the look it works out if it's you know uh, 70 or 90 degrees outside uh, this is a very just nice chill, uh, bright, uh, summer-esque outfit for, um, for, yeah, just hanging out and about. So, uh, this is the first look, my favorite look, and, uh, yeah, let's move on to the next. All right, so this is more of a fall look, I would say. Uh, got the hoodie on, still a bit hot for, you know, wearing this outdoors, still maybe highs of, uh, 89 over in Georgia at the moment. But in the fall time, I could definitely see myself wearing this. I think the hoodie could be a little bit too saturated, but I mean, it kind of matches up with the, uh, with the cotton on shirt. But again, you're outside, it'll level everything out with the sunlight. And, um, yeah, the not rainy day. I wouldn't even wear these boots in the rain, but not rainy day in the fall time you know, go to like an apple orchard or something. Um, this is a look that I could definitely get down with. So um, yeah, let's move on to the next. All right, so changing it up to more 
of a darker outfit, but this is where the, the accessories and the accents really start to shine. So it kept the hat on at the same tan color hat, and now it contrasts really nicely with the all black and the uh, sand colorway of the boots. And then as like another kind of uh, Easter egg, you got the, uh, the pull tabs on the, on the hoodie as well. Apologize, making sure this mic is in a good position. But um, yeah, I really like this. Now here's what I wouldn't do. I would not mix a, a black upper with the tan pants. And I wouldn't do it vice versa either. So I wouldn't do black pants and then the uh, tan upper. I just don't think I could pull that off really well. I've tried it before and I it, it, it would look okay, you know, it depends really on the style of the clothing that you wear. But just in general, I much prefer, you know, keep it the accents uh, with the tan if you're going to do a black upper and match a black upper with the black uh, pants or black pants with the black upper. That's just my preference there. But anyway, let's move on to the next. And here we have my outfit for the day. Cotton on black shirt matched with the black joggers cut at the bottom and uh, sand colorway, but keeping the tan hat once again. I really like this look a lot. I think it contrasts perfectly and is really nice for, you know, summertime too, just because of how light and uh, flowy that this shirt is and the fact that it's like a woven cotton so the air just goes right through it. So um, though it may look hot to the naked eye, it's actually a very cool outfit, just as cool as wearing the whole tan and lighter colorway, uh, really exclusively because of the material of the shirt and how it's made. And um, and also another note on breathability, the uh, tactical boots aren't that breathable, to be honest. They are pretty insulated, actually, which is going to be good, of course, for winter and fall time. So take what you will with that. But yeah, one of my favorite looks. And uh, yeah, let's move on to the next. OK, so I threw the blue jeans on and I looked in the mirror. And to be honest, I'm liking this look a lot more than I thought I would. I think it just gives it it's not like wearing the black pants with these. If I wore the black pants with this outfit, I wouldn't like it. But because blue jeans are just a little bit brighter, gives it and it complements okay with the uh, with you know the color of the of of the tan with the with the shade of the tan. I don't know. It just gives it that little splash of color contrast to make it work out. And um, let me know what y'all think about this outfit. I really can't describe this look. I haven't seen many people pull off this look before, so uh, let me know what you think, if you think it looks good or, or not. But um, yeah, just looking in the mirror, I kind of like it, but I'm not going to wear it out today. I'm going to wear that other outfit that I was wearing. But um, really, y'all, that's all I got to say about styling with the Yeezy 500 High Tactical Boots in the sand colorway. Um, let me know if you want to see one with the black pair, and you want to see the black pair contrasted with some tan, with some white, uh, and maybe other colors as well. I've been kind of expanding my wardrobe a bit, you know, including some different colors in there. So I've been experimenting a bit and so far it's been a lot of fun. So anyway, thanks for watching as always and more soon.